Hi, this is Ed Scholtek with Sandler Training, and I'm going to talk today about rule number 13, no mind reading. I remember we had a client who was telling us a story about a particular prospect that had called them. They actually own a large video firm, and they produce and edit videos for corporate companies. And he got a call from the HR senior VP, asking them to talk a little bit about his business. So, of course, he did. Evidently, the call went well because he got an appointment out of it. So he shows up at that particular meeting pretty eager to talk about his company. And in that room were a lot of senior executives he didn't have a chance to talk to prior to the meeting. And so he started talking about himself. And, of course, the agenda that he had set was the opposite of what the executive team wanted to discuss. He had neglected on the phone call to ask questions. He assumed what the agenda was, and he went with his gut instinct on that and ended up not getting the sale. So think of it this way. There's a couple key responsibilities that a salesperson has. Number one, you have to determine what the prospect's expectations are and clear intentions are. You don't want to be doing mind reading going into a meeting with folks that you haven't met before. Secondly, you need to help the prospect be as specific as possible on what their needs are. Sometimes they're not aware of everything they may need, and it's the salesperson's job to flush that out. Thirdly, they've got to tie up any loose ends that may occur at that meeting. And fourthly, they need to be in sync with what their agenda is, what their expectations are, with what the prospect's expectations are. Remember, Rule 13, no mind reading when that big deal comes across your desk.